Hi everyone, it's Natasha of natashaskitchen.com and this is our go-to recipe for homemade pie crust. It's a tender, flaky crust with rich, buttery flavor and it's all natural with only butter and no shortening. Homemade pie crust is quick and easy to make. In the bowl of a food processor, combine two and a half cups of flour, half a tablespoon of sugar, and half a teaspoon of salt. Pulse those together to combine. Now you'll need half a pound of unsalted cold butter straight from the fridge. Dice the butter into small pieces, then transfer it into the food processor. Pulse the mixture together until coarse crumbs form with some pea-sized pieces, then stop mixing. It should be dry and powdery at this point. Now add exactly 6 tablespoons of ice water, then pulse just until moist clumps or small balls form. To test if you've added enough water, press some of the dough between your fingertips and it should stick together. If you overmix or add too much water, the dough will be sticky and difficult to roll out. Transfer the dough to a clean work surface and pull it together quickly with your hands. Do not knead the dough at this point, just pull it together. Now divide it in half and flatten to form two equal discs. Wrap each disc in a sheet of plastic wrap and chill in the refrigerator. All right, you wanna wrap these up in plastic wrap and refrigerate for at least an hour, and then you can use them for any recipe that calls for pie dough. Hey girl, you ready for pie? Yeah, what kind of pie should I make? Um, pasta one. A pasta one? Okay, maybe not any recipe. <laughs> what other kind of pie do you like? <gasps> blueberry pie. That's what we'll do. I'll make you a blueberry pie, okay? Let's go put this in the refrigerator. You wanna do it? Yeah. Perfect, thank you. Let's go. We'll see you next time. Hey, before you go, if you're looking to improve your cooking skills, check out some of our favorite tips and tutorials right over here and click below to subscribe. And when you do, make sure to click that little bell icon and you'll get notifications every time we post a new recipe. We'll see you next time.